Sebastian Vettel fires warning to Ferrari teammate Charles Leclerc ahead of Australian GP Ferrari have looked strong in winter practice and have been tipped to have an impressive start to the season. And Vettel is hoping that the 2019 F1 World Championship will be the year he reclaims the driver's title from Mercedes driver Lewis Hamilton. He faces stiff competition from inside his own team, however, as Leclerc looks to make a positive impact on his first season driving for the prancing horse. Leclerc, just 21 years old, is competing in just his second season of F1 racing, and is keen to make a good impression from the off. Vettel spoke on Wednesday to explain that he was wary of the challenge coming from the youngster. The four-time F1 champion also dismissed suggestions that Leclerc was there to make him look good. I think it's very clear, and I think Masia, Bonato, Ferrari team principal, also made it very clear, we are free to race each other, he declared. I think Charles will do his best to help himself, to help the team and that's the same for me. In the end we are racing for Ferrari. That means we'll try to get Ferrari back to where we've been trying to get it back to the last couple of years. That's the main priority. Leclerc spoke to reporters on Thursday and responded to Vettel's claims, issuing a challenge of his own. The godson of late Jules Bianchi warned Vettel that he is coming for the lead driver's role in the Ferrari setup. In any team there needs to be a number one and a number two in a 50-50 situation. He admitted. But then also on my side it's my job to turn things around. It's not going to be easy, I have a lot to learn, but I'll push for that. Next news F1 News, Sebastian Vettel makes Ferrari admission ahead of Australian Grand Prix. Vettel is entering into his fifth year with the Ferrari F1 team on Sunday and will be looking to win his first driver's championship with the Scuderia. The German is a four-time world champion, having won consecutive championships whilst a Red Bull driver, but has failed to take the extra step with Ferrari. However, Vettel is confident this year after a strong winter testing off-season. Ferrari looked strong again and set the pace in Barcelona and Vettel has been labelled as one of the favourites to take home the crown this year. Whilst at Ferrari, he has been under constant pressure from Italian media to lead the prancing horse to glory once again, given that the team has gone 11 years since winning the Constructors' Championship. But the 31-year-old insisted that he is not paying any attention to the criticism or any expectation placed upon him. I'm not sure the media is going to make a big difference unless you can somehow transfer points to my account, he joked. I think it's a new year, obviously, there have been, some changes. Of course we will be focused trying to do our job as good as we can. I think there's a lot of passion inside this team that's willing to get out and expressing ourselves, I think, through winning is the best we can do so that's the target. But as I said, there's so many races, such a long way, so many things we are depending on but as much as we can control things we try to take them in our hand and get our job done. As I said, so far the atmosphere is good, the spirit is right inside the team and yeah, we try to carry that into the season. In terms of expectations. I think it's normal when you finished second the year before that the way to look at it is that it is a disaster because you finished second so in that way, finishing second, third or fourth is all the same disaster. The winner takes it all, so in that case Lewis has been in that position the last years and we try to turn it around. Next news Lewis Hamilton's dad fires Sebastian Vettel warning ahead of Australian Grand Prix. Ferrari have made impressive improvements over the winter and are expected to be the quickest team this season. 
Mercedes have won the championship double for the last five years but Vettel is hopeful of ending Ferrari's 12-year title drought. However, Anthony Hamilton insists his son will not give up the battle for his sixth world title. And he says the 33-year-old will fight all the way to the end, regardless of the performance of his car. It is too early to tell but I know one thing, Hamilton told Sky Sports F1. Well we all know one thing, Lewis is not the sort of driver that just lets things lie. He is going to chase and chase and chase to the end. He is looking for another championship this year. Hamilton was the quickest in both practice sessions at the Australian Grand Prix this morning. But Ferrari were holding something back ahead of qualifying tomorrow. And Vettel is excited to see what he can get out of his new car. I think it's a new year, obviously, there have been, some changes, the German said. Of course we will be focused trying to do our job as good as we can. I think there's a lot of passion inside this team that's willing to get out and expressing ourselves, I think, through winning, is the best we can do so that's the target. In terms of expectations, I think it's normal when you finished second the year before that the way to look at it is that it is a disaster because you finished second so in that way, finishing second, third or fourth is all the same disaster. The winner takes it all. So in that case Lewis has been in that position the last years and we try to turn it around. Next news Sebastian Vettel, James Allen reveals the problem F1 star has at Ferrari. Sebastian Vettel's four consecutive titles from 2010 until 2013 put him at the very top of the driver's rankings and the German is likely to have had one eye on Michael Schumacher's record total of seven. However, Vettel has suffered five difficult seasons since his last triumph, and although three of those have been with Ferrari. He will be hoping this season's car can give him a major boost. One doubt that Vettel will have heading into Sunday's opening race in Melbourne is his relationship with prodigy Charles Leclerc, who has been tipped for big things this season. James Allen, a former commentator for BBC and ITV, has pondered the possible relationship between the pair and has predicted what could happen if Leclerc is to outperform his teammate. The question mark then is on Sebastian Vettel, he had a poor year last year and I think he was very up and down, when he was up he was fantastic, but he made a lot of mistakes, Allen exclusively told Express Sport. It would be understandable for Ferrari to be questioning of him and maybe even slightly doubting of him. It's a bit like Jurgen Klopp said, he needs to turn the doubters into believers, I think internally at Ferrari that's Vittel's mission really, the first four or five races of the season he needs to settle everyone down, win some races, and get control of the championship and not make mistakes. Vettel finished a mammoth 88 points behind five-time champion Lewis Hamilton last time out, but Ferrari's performances and testing have given fans hope that the prancing horse could secure a first title since the constructors' triumph of 2008. Apart from Hamilton, Leclerc is tipped by Allen to be Vettel's biggest challenger for the F1 title this season, alongside Red Bull's Max Verstappen. Leclerc, is one to watch, apart from Verstappen, who is yet to fully prove himself, despite being on the tour for a few years, Allen added. I haven't been this excited about a new driver coming into Formula 1 since Lewis Hamilton as I am about Charles Leclerc. This is Leclerc's second season, everything I saw of him last year was exactly what I expected having watched him in Formula 2 and Formula 3 the feeder categories. This is an exceptional talent within an exception head, and at the end of the day, Formula 1 happens in the head as much as it happens on the race track, it's a head game.
He has got an unbelievable racing brain and a brilliant race mentality so he is the one to watch for me without a shadow of a doubt. The season opener in Melbourne was first held in 1928 and qualifying for the 2019 showpiece will take place on Saturday with the race beginning on Sunday at 5.10 am UK time. James Allen spoke to Express Sport in his role as president of, the destination for millions of cars and racing fans. Thank you for watching the video. Be sure to share and subscribe to your channel to get the latest sports news around the world. Wished health and success. Goodbye.